Everybody has a different standard of living. But for me, the meaning of living is to do my passion as career and pay the bills in time. Hey, it's that. Anna looks so freaking beautiful. Nah, ini kayak pakai extension bulu mata sih, bagus banget. So, yeah, we have a million of our five favorite products. And why we love it? Why is it as a problem solver? So, this is our beauty ABC induction. Indeed, to achieve that, get a proper job is a goal for myself. Arrive as a work holiday visa holder, I have proof nothing can stop myself to achieve my goal because I believe in myself and well prepared as well. Here in this vlog, I would like to share to you how I make a living in Australia or known as Down Under. Hi everyone, I'm Kanti Wijaya, a holder of Work Holiday Visa Australia 2019 and in this vlog, I would like to share to you how I can get my dream job in Australia Yes, I arrived here on October 26, 2019 and my first job is on Melbourne Cup uh, It was November 5th and today, uh, November 20 I start my first day work with Benefit Australia so it's such a, such a blessing for me I would like to say that I'm very blessed but I guess I'm the one who very prepared so not only me you also can get a future here uh, maybe you wonder what's going on now in Australia the situation now is a lot of immigrants here you compete not only with the citizen of Australia but you compete with a lot of work holiday visa holder from Europe, from US international student so that's why you have to be very clear about your purpose, your career, your differentiations and how can you be noticed here don't worry, I will share everything that I've done for myself and hope this vlog can help you as well don't worry everyone I have attached every link on the description below so what you have to do is to watch easily and then pay attention for what I'm saying when you arrive here you have to prepare first bank account and second is TFN tax file number get your insurance it's very important to have your insurance here I choose Bupa and I also attach the link uh, what kind of insurance that I buy for myself One of the biggest industry in Australia is lifestyle, content creation, hospitality it's something that this country actually look for so I just focus myself on that what I'm preparing is to get the license a lot of license here guys even if you want to go to fishing you have to get a license or you get a fine so what I'm prepared is when I arrive here I, I straightly book for RSA test so this is my RSA plus um, 140 this is the license that I got so I can work in hospital business um, on the great events big events let's say Melbourne Cup with the uh, reputable agency after you prepare your RSA um, you also have to able to prepare yourself with special skill talking about special skill Everybody here is very busy. They also want to look good, but yeah, the service here is pretty expensive. This country need actually is beauty technicians. Before I arrived to Australia, I prepare myself to take a last leave course at Live Your Last ID with Stephanie Dewi, my teacher. Uh, she helps me a lot uh, in learning last leave and I'm using the products from here which is uh, the best in the whole world the Lush Leaf Serum is Alabana yeah prepare myself for that you also have to prepare your personal branding and I work a lot with social media to uh, promote who I am as you know back in Indonesia I was working as self-partner I was selling my talent my 
um, ability in marketing, communications, and hospitality. So that's why when I arrive here, I'm not really shocked that I have prepared everything. For example, video who I am. Second, social media. You have to prepare your Instagram properly, make the right feeds. Uh, because people here, they're checking your social media. And um, please don't be too lazy to go out and networking, not only to Indonesians, but to all whoever here. Just say hi and make a friends, go out. You also have to make a proper CV. Uh, I attach my uh, CV websites. It's actually from Canva. This is my CV. Um, I hope it's uh, helpful to you too. Uh, I'm very specific in writing my CV and also make a proper photo. Uh, it's not a selfie photo. Just prepare yourself with special skill for in case something happen, you always can survive within yourself and also work wisely, not work within lowering your pride or self-worth. I would like to share to you how can I get approved by many jobs when I arrive here. So this is how I write email. I mentioned to the clients that who I am and who is Kanti Wijaya. Within four minutes, you can see who I am, which is that's really helpful for the client. They are busy with hundreds of CV for a day. If someone send them a video and say, hey, it's only four minutes, please watch it. I bet you won't be regret. They would love to do that. So this is my email. After I send the email, Less than 24 hours, I got a call of a job in hospitality. So what I can say that work in Australia, it needs you to be ready with everything. If someone complained that, oh, I don't have enough job, I don't have enough money, I hate my job. It's time for you to evaluate yourself and see yourself in the higher point of view. How can you differentiate yourself? That's the only key to you to survive in the city like Sydney, the biggest city in the whole world where you compete not only with Asians, not only with Australian, but also European, American. That's why it's time for you to be different. After I got the emails, what you have to do is to prepare yourself with interview and inductions. What is induction? Well, different than Jakarta, people here, they really want to make sure you are ready for everything. So they, before you got a job, you got an induction, you train uh, by them to make sure that you can execute everything perfectly. And um, my, for example, I've been to many induction from different, different events, for, but for my current job uh, with Benefit Australia, this is how I do my induction. So first is interview, and second they ask me to do a, a test working, which is they want to see me how I apply makeup and um, how can I serve customer, how can I help customer with benefit products, and the third they ask me to do induction with um, Meyer, which is where you can find benefit in Sydney, Australia. After I got an induction, they also give me a book of inductions so you can count how many steps of later I can get a job in benefit. After I finish this induction book uh, with the uh, management from Benefit Australia, they also want me to do a test drawing. So yeah, I will do a drawing. Um, of my customer's face within the benefit products and after I finish all the steps I'm ready to work you have to be understand your skills your talent and please don't settle less please work wisely and just know your standard and know your value because some people would like to take you for granted and I won't let that happen to me too. My advice for you guys, work in Australia, it's different than Indonesia. Here, you have to be different, you have to be relatable, 
you have to be real and you have to be authentic it's mean that you get a job because you deserve it not because of the networking you have to be very different you have to be very like one of the kind please do so and whoever say to you finding job is hard I can tell you one thing everything comes with the mind if you say it's easy it's going to be easy but if you say vice versa you get what you think so for my advice just don't settle less just trust in your heart trust in your intuitions believe change the way you're thinking and you get it what you deserve I hope that this vlog can help you and encourage you to get a job here in Australia or do you think you want to change your career don't be afraid just follow your heart uh, I see you in the next vlog thank you everyone for watching my vlog by the way uh, if you have any questions or do you need any advice please comment below I would love to give a feedback and I hope you can be inspired to within this vlog see you in the next vlog bye